So last night I did a great big no-no and I wasn't sure if it was a great big no-no until today when I got a big fat spanking from Santa Muerte. Um, even in the tarot, as soon as I opened it up, um, a certain card popped up that was, you know, in direct correlation with what I did wrong. Um, yeah, she calls you out. <laughs> When you screw up, she um, she definitely lets you know you screwed up. So now I need to figure out how to make amends. And um, I am going to do a lot of crawling on my knees and a lot of butt kissing and a lot of whatever I got to do. I feel I disrespected her. I feel I may have um, hurt her. Um, I mean, I don't know if deities have feelings like humans do. I'm sure they do. And, you know, if you have somebody that is, that you're embracing as your child and they go and they do something wrong, it must hurt, you know, because I'm a mother. I know when my children do things that I don't approve of, it's you know, it's a little painful. So, um, I can't imagine how she feels. And then I watched Janelle's video yesterday about, um, how, you know, she's the middle person. She gets questions from both sides. We're asking her, you know, WTF. And then, you know, God is asking her WTF, you know, and, you know, all the stuff that she goes for, goes through for humanity. And it brought a tear to my eye when I was watching the video, thinking about it. And then right after I watch that video, I go and I do this stupid fucking thing. And, um, I just feel like such a shit. And, um, I love her dearly, and I hope that she forgives me. I really hope that she forgives me. I'm trying hard, and I'm swaying. I'm swaying different ways because I don't know which way is the right way when all I have to do is ask, even though I just feel so lost without my statues right now. But... It's not the statue. Somebody commented on my page that she's in my heart, and she is, and I need to remember that. I need to remember that just because I don't have a huge, you know, four-foot statue of her in front of me, that that doesn't mean that I'm abandoned. And, um, you know, I don't even have her rosaries, like, they rushed me out of there so quick I didn't have time to grab anything and her rosaries were hanging above my bed on my wall so they would be there while I slept because they were purple and purple is um, like you know um, it can be um, associated with divination it can be um, so I hung them above my bed and I'm just like, I, I didn't even have a chance to grab them. And I'm like heartbroken. I just bought her a candle, a beautiful candle. Um, can't give it to her, <laughs> can't put it on her altar, but I tied it real tight in the bag until I can get everything out on the first and um, actually give it to her. Um, and I'm not, I'm not buying her gifts because I'm like, oh, I need to make amends. I actually was in the store. I smelled it. It reminded me of her and how the altar smelled with the flowers and, and things like that. And I, it immediately just came to mind like, oh, you know, Santa Muerte would love that. And so I got it. And um, I even lost my um, derm this morning. Like she, she's been, you know, playing with me you know, spanking me, um, so, um, but yeah, I am going to, um, say some prayers and hope that she 
forgives me. And I'm posting this video because like she's just no no joke and you know, she I mean when we devote ourselves to her, we need to be devout. And you know, to her and not go screwing around and doing stupid shit. Um, she is associated with Christianity and I fought that. I fought it tooth and nail. And last night was when I, and I had just watched the damn video and, and I, you know, and um, I called upon an, another deity for help, a male deity that is not a good deity and um, she did not approve I didn't ask her permission I should have asked her permission the whole time I was doing it I was thinking in my head I hope you're okay with this I didn't get anything because I was already doing it so she was probably already angry with me because I had, was just doing it and saying I hope you're not mad um, so, yeah, just, um, I don't even know what the message is with all this. I guess it's whatever you can take from it. Um, but I really feel like I, I screwed up and I'm really scared to lose her because she has been my rock, you know, and, um, she's done so much for me and she's helped me and she's gotten me through every hard time that I've had and everything that I've gone through like she did like she doesn't give you what you want she gives you what you need and everything I've gone through I've definitely needed even though I might not have thought so at the time and I'm hurting I'm in front of the church right now. Orthodox. Um, you know, but um, I'm gonna ask for forgiveness. And I um, hope that she forgives me. That's all, and um, Many blessings to everybody. I hope um, everybody's staying safe. And, you know, just um, learn, learn from your mistakes and trust in her that she'll take care of you. You don't need anybody else. You really don't.